Hello everyone, I bring you greetings in the name of the Lord. It's a joy to come your way today and I am so happy. I am so blessed to have you here with me. I pray that the Lord bless you and the Lord meet you at the very point of your needs. In this month, I pray that the Lord lift you up in the name of Jesus. I pray that on the table of life, you will flourish and excel in the name of Jesus. The Lord bless you and the Lord make you a blessing to people around you and to this generation. I pray that this new month, just as the word of God says in Psalm 23 verse 5, that thou prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. The Lord will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemies. In the name of Jesus, this month you will celebrate in style. This month you will be blessed beyond all expectations. In the name of Jesus. As David said in Psalm 23, 5, he said, Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of my enemies. Thou anointest my head with oil, my cup runs over. The Lord will anoint your head with oil. The Lord will anoint your head with oil of joy, oil of gladness in the name of Jesus. The Lord will anoint your head with fresh oil in the name of Jesus and your cup will run over. In the name of Jesus, I pray that the Lord fill your cup with blessings. The Lord fill your cup with peace. The Lord fill your cup with love and your blessings will be full and it will run over in the name of Jesus. Just as the Lord did for David, you know, he prepared a table before him in the presence of his enemies and he anointed his head with oil. When the Lord wants to bless you, he will expose your enemies. He's not exposing your enemies for them to hurt you or harm you. The Lord is exposing your enemies so that they can witness your greatness, so that they can witness your celebration. The Lord is exposing your enemies so that they can see the hand of God on you, in your life, so that they can see the glory of God upon your life, so that they can see the beauty of the Lord upon your life. That shall be your testimony this month in the name of Jesus. You know, the Lord made David calm among his enemies. Why? Well, because David trusted so much in the Lord. David knew that God was always by his side. I tell you, God is by your side. Be calm. God will calm your fears and you'll be able to relax. You'll be able to be yourself this month in the name of Jesus. In the midst of danger, in the midst of fear, in the midst of terror and challenges. You know, David was so calm. May you be calm. No matter what that situation is, be calm because God is in charge. I tell you, all you need to do is to be calm. Why? Because God is in charge. God made abundant provision for David. And that is why he was able to celebrate. God will make abundant provision for you this month. It is your month of abundance. It is your month of goodness. It is your month of joy. And it is your month of celebration. God will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemies. In the name of Jesus. Enemies are everywhere. Enemies are around. Enemies are within. Enemies are outside. But we don't have to worry about our enemies. Why? Because God is taking care of them. And that's why he said what we can do for them is to pray for them. And while we are praying for them, God is helping us and is taking us to higher levels. Well, because we have passed that stage of praying against the enemy. We don't need to do that. People may have mocked you. People may have talked you down. People may have despised you. People may have painted you black. People may have fostered hateful designs against you. But God is ready to lift you up and to celebrate you in style. And all those people that have mocked and, 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 and talked against you, they are coming to celebrate you in the name of Jesus. No matter what people say, that doesn't stop God from blessing you. No matter what people do, that doesn't stop God from blessing you. And I want to let you know that it's not about what you have done wrong or right. No matter what you do, people will always talk. Even when you do things right, people will talk. So you don't need to be worried or you don't need to really, you know, be disturbed about what people do or say. All you need to do is to please God. Once your way pleases God, it will make your enemies to be at peace with you. So all you need to look into is how to please God, how to love him, how to follow him, how to do his will. That's all you need to do. And God will make your enemies to be at peace with you in the name of Jesus. No matter what man does to you, let God fight for you. Just as it says in Exodus 14, 14, 
He says, I will fight for you and you will hold your peace. You will have your peace. God will fight for you and you will have your peace in the name of Jesus. When man judges you, God will always vindicate you. When man brings you down, God will always lift you up. When man mars you, God will always make you. When man disappoints you, God will always compensate you. And we thank God for this month. And we know that this new month is going to be a month of greatness. It's going to be a month of joy for us. And I pray that this month God is setting a table before us in the presence of our enemies. We are at the tipping point of what God is about to do. God wants to embarrass you and I with his goodness. And I pray that this month will deliver its increase for us. In the name of Jesus. Whatever God has portioned for you and I this month, we will not miss it. And I pray that this month, no evil, no harm, no hurt will come near you and I. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will deliver you from evil of the day and evil of the night. The Lord will deliver you and I from the devices of the crafty. The hands of evildoers will not prevail over our lives in the name of Jesus. The Lord will shield you and the Lord will protect you. The Lord will be your keeper. He will be your shield in the name of Jesus. In this new month, we shall celebrate and we shall be celebrated. Every day in this month, we usher us into the plan, into the will, and into the purpose of God for our lives. We shall not die, but we shall live to declare the goodness of the Lord. This new month launches us into greatness. It launches us into our blessings. It launches us into new opportunities in the name of Jesus. There is no pain, no sickness around us this month. In the name of Jesus, affliction is far away from us. Trouble is far away from us. Calamity is far away from us. This month brings us into joy. It brings us into peace. It brings us into love. It brings us into strength. It brings us into new discoveries of good and great things in the name of Jesus. God bless you. Thank you so much for staying with me till this time. I pray that God bless you. God keep you and cause his face to shine upon you. Enjoy your day and enjoy your month in Jesus name. Amen. Until I come your way again, stay blessed and stay safe. Bye for now.